The Hartford Healthcare Heart and Vascular Institute is a conglomeration of seven hospitals throughout our system, throughout Connecticut, and it's comprised of numerous cardiologists, electrophysiologists, interventional cardiologists, heart surgeons, and vascular surgeons. So it's a vast network of physicians who are dedicated to heart and vascular care. So the goal of the Heart and Vascular Institute is to coordinate the multidisciplinary care team so that we focus on the patient and deliver a quality experience for the patient. And that doesn't just focus on Hartford Hospital, but it's a continuation of care outside of the borders of Connecticut, so we become a destination center for cardiovascular services. What's really great about the Heart and Vascular Institute model is that we've broken down the traditional silos and barriers in medicine and combined the elements of different departments that are dealing with the heart and vascular systems. We've brought together vascular surgeons, cardiothoracic surgeons, cardiologists, everyone who deals with the heart and vasculature into one structure instead of having it divided out between different departments. And that ensures that you have all the expertise that you need in the one place to treat the patient. Some of the advanced procedures we do at the Hartford Healthcare Heart and Vascular Institute Division of Electrophysiology are complex ablations, his bundle pacing, and laser lead extraction. We benefit our patients uh, tremendously, uh, and it's just a, a very great group of individuals, both in our device clinic, following um, patients with pacemakers and defibrillators, as well as our interventional laboratories doing ablation procedures and advanced um, implantations of uh, pacing both uh, from the left and right sides of the heart, which has been incredible uh, advance in the management of people with um, decomposite heart failure. And I've had the experience of saving people from having to go on to uh, transplants and mechanical uh, assist devices by applying uh, our pacing um, technology. A service we try to provide to new patient populations is patient-centered care. By that I mean we try to evaluate them and see them close to their home and try to manage their illness and issues as close as possible to institutions near their home. This institution is unique for doctors and practicing medicine because they truly care about patient population, being at the cutting edge, and making sure that we always do the right thing. Uh, one of the very interesting things that we're involved in is a virtual preceptorship program to teach the technique of his bundle pacing to physicians around the country and around the world. Over the last year, we've had nearly 200 physicians and professionals from a variety of countries take part in our program, and hopefully we'll continue that program into the future. The Institute, um, from a community outreach perspective, um, really touts quality outcomes. So when I look at the collection and the camaraderie with the physicians and in the recruitment of our A players, that is really the draw for our patients, that we are here to deliver not only a quality patient experience, but the best experience for the families as well. And one of the things that we realized two years ago is that we lacked in the infrastructure and we lacked in the amenities that patients are looking for when they come to an organization, especially based in a city. So we did build a new state-of-the-art EP lab, a prep and recovery area where patients can have a solid experience and have something positive in terms of an outcome when they leave the organization. As we've been able to integrate those that have built the foundation here at Hartford HealthCare with new volume and new practitioners that have augmented the success that HHC had built over the prior years. The Hartford HealthCare Heart and Vascular Institute is unique, I feel, in the fact that the administration is extremely supportive financially of the physicians and the other healthcare providers and allows us to provide cutting edge technology for our patients. The future um, is in our ability to do interventions like ablations, like devices, um, to really help our patients live longer and more healthy lives. So when I look at where we were two years ago to where we are now, we're pushing the borders of Massachusetts, we're pushing the borders of Rhode Island, um, we're looking to develop a heart and vascular institute now in South Fairfield. So when I look at our footprint, the key for us as an institute is to continue to expand that footprint with key quality physicians and the best practitioners so that we can get beyond a regional reputation to more of a national reputation. And that's certainly our goal as a heart and vascular institute. Thank you.